Hi everyone, my name is Bindu. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to show you how to create dynamic titles for a visual in Power BI. Without any delay, let's get started. When you are creating a Power BI report, you will always have a header to a visual, which on a high level explains what that visual means. So when you have a slicer which slices the data in the, in the visual, then it will be very professional for you to change the title based on the slicer value we selected. In general, by default, the heading, the header will be a static value. But now in this video, we will see how to change that based on the slicer value we picked up. Let's see how we do that. If you look at my screen here, I created a simple report which shows the sales by category. So here, I, I want to change the header of this visual when I select the particular year here. So when I say 2016, I want the uh, header of this visual to be changed as sales by category for 2016. If I don't select any visual, I want it to be sales by category for all years. Okay, let's see how we do that. So to create the dynamic titles, to create a dynamic header, we need to create a measure first. Okay, let's create the measure now. I'm creating new measure here. And I'll save the, and I'm just giving the measure name as some selected year. Okay. And um, this is the static value for the header. Sales by category for Okay. And now I want to concatenate the value that gets changed that we select in the slicer. So uh, for concatenating, we'll uh, use ampersand here and the function we use is selected value. Selected value dot and it depends on the date value, right? On the, uh, on the date field. So you go to order date and in order date, you want to see the year there dot year so and this gives me this this gives me the selected value whatever i select but if i don't select any value i need to get all years right so for that i'll be giving all years value as another parameter and that's all you just close this and you're done Okay, now you created this measure. After creating this measure, what do you do? After creating this measure, you need to include this measure in this visual. In whatever visual you want to change the text dynamically, you include that measure in that visual. Okay, so I want to change the title for this visual. So I select on this visual and go to format here. And in format, you have title here, right? So you click on this and you see this um, FX here. So here you'll be able to change the title dynamically. And here and here you just leave it by field value and the title text will be based on the field, on the measure we created. So for based on the field property, you select the measure we just created and that will be selected here. And then you just say, okay, that's all. So here in my visual, because here in this slicer, because I haven't selected any of the values here, my um, header, my text here says sales by category for all years. Okay. And now let's change it to some other year. So I changed for 2018 the, and the title text changed here to 2018 sales category by 2018. If I change to 2017, it will be 2017. So this is how you dynamically change the header of a visual. I hope this is clear now. If you have any questions, please ask them in the comment section below. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do subscribe and see you in the next video. Thank you.